<laughs> Hi folks, I've got another little adventure today. Well, it might be an adventure, it might not. I honestly don't know how this one's gonna turn out. Basically just out there, there's a cave. Well, I found a cave and where there's a little hole in the grass and you can hear the sea going boom and stuff like that. It connects out to the sea and when it's high tide it's just water going through and it looks pretty dangerous like super dangerous because the swell's going through and you didn't hit your top piece on the rocks but what i'm going to do i'm waiting for the tide to go down and i'm going to go climb down there and try and swim into this cave and just see how far back it goes because the house we're in at the moment might well be right on top of this cave and i wonder if anyone knows and by the way it's crystal's birthday so happy birthday crystal so it's December, um, we're up in the very far north of Scotland here and it's really cold and it's half two in the afternoon, it's about to get dark. This wetsuit's been outdoors all night and it's absolutely frozen. It's one of those ones where you have to get it wet to put it on. Right, I'm quite excited. I often get excited before I do something stupid for your entertainment. Icicles. When the tide's up, it's absolutely full when the swell comes powering through here. Here's a clip of it a few hours ago. Different story now the tide's down. Quite scenic though. Those massive boulders up overhead, look. You just hope they're wedged in nice and tight. It's really, really cold, but I don't feel a thing in this wetsuit. It's open self, so it's like the unlined neoprene on the inside. big this cave is. It may not be very big at all. So manage your excitement right now. But Here we are. Yeah, there you go. That massive anchor chain in there. history in this area. Could be something to do with that. Decent. You never know doing stuff like this. You never know what you're getting in here. Let's take it easy. I think the obligatory pigeons have already flown out. <coughs> There's the fishing boys. And all, always fishing boys. Let's see, there might even be a bottle of these things. Oh cool, look at that. Okay. Okay, officially a wee bit scared. He's 
quite excited. Let's see if I can find the hole. buttons on the side which would give it things to detonate it. Oh man this is a big cave. Oh my goodness. This cave is so much bigger than I thought. Right guys from here on I'm gonna have to stop shining this torch in my face to talk to you because then when I look away I can't see anything so I'll just narrate this from behind the camera there's something up the back there oh my word look at this cave it's huge scale what is that? it's like a little secret grotto of smashed up lobster pots climbing up the walls, look. Alright guys, what are you saying? I'm saying this is one of the best times yet. I am absolutely buzzing about this. I had no idea it was going to be this good. If you like that sort of thing. This is so much better than I thought. No stalactites, just lots of these things. Are giant wood lights, look at the side of them. Everywhere. Giant cave wood lice. <laughs> You've seen it here first. Like and subscribe. I hope I hope you're enjoying watching this. Because I love doing stuff like this. I find it really exciting. Excellent. Another cave. I think there are millions more like this. Right, I'm going to make my way out now. How long though? From there to the back. You can't even see the back now, it's a long way in. I'm going to say 45 metres. I'll give that one 45 metres. Celebration. I'm going to end this video here. I really hope you like that. I enjoy making it as always. I'm going to try and keep the videos coming through the winter, but it's difficult. One thing and another. 
there's always another adventure, that's the best thing. If you've not subscribed already, consider doing so. You'll make my day. Don't make any money, just makes me happy. See you next time, folks. Cheers, bye-bye.